Hey there, thanks for taking the time to watch this presentation with us. We're going to go through these slides and kind of break down what we're all about here at All County, uh, Colorado Springs Property Management, and what we can do for you. What do you want from your rentals? You want to make management easy for you, keep your property well maintained, recruit responsible tenants, keep tenants in the property, and keep costs low and income high. In other words, you want to make good money without a lot of hassle, and that's why we're here. What should you look for in a property management company? One, you're going to want qualifications. Two, you're going to want to know about how their staff is and what they can handle. How's their communication? How do they do marketing? And what ties do they have to the community? Um, this is a picture of the office. We moved in here in March 2020. Um, we maintain both levels of this um, office building downtown, 811 South Tejon, Colorado Springs, Colorado. Um, we're right off I-25, so we're almost always minutes from, from your door to make sure we can check on it as soon as possible if need be. Here's a quick rundown of our qualifications. We do have 30 years of experience. Um, we manage, right now it's actually closer to about 500 doors, but it's always at least 450 doors um, here in Colorado Springs, single family and multifamily homes. Um, we employ some of the most cutting edge technology systems and programs to help monitor your property, um, keep paper trails of the necessary documentations and, and just all around keep, keep your property up and running right. Um, we have certifications um, all over the place. Some of our different licensed realtors and staff here. Um, every single one of us are, are part of NARFM, which is the National Association of Realtors and Property Managers. Um, it's a big company for, for folks doing what we do. Um, here's kind of a quick rundown of our team, as you can see pictures of everybody. Um, the next slide here is going to show a quick um, rundown. We'll also send this to the packet, but kind of has a, a brief description of what everybody does and, and has done and what their experience is here um, in reference to property management. And you also have a copy of this again in the packets that we send you. Um, this is good for if you can't fall asleep at night, you can scroll through this and, and read these ones. So these are a list of the communication tools that we use. Um, Rent Manager is kind of the main hub that we use. All the documentation um, and everything, all your statements will be saved and sent out through Rent Manager. Um, it just helps us track everything and it literally tracks everything A to B involved with your property. Um, the property meld is the one the tenants are gonna use for reporting any maintenance issues. Um, that's a great little tool, it helps us track um, exactly when a tenant sent in a request for maintenance, um, what our maintenance team said to them as far as self-diagnosis, um, and if a vendor's needed to be sent out, it'll say when that vendor um, was sent uh, the work order, if you will, or what we call the meld. And then it will also um, track when the vendor is in communication with the tenants to assign the work, um, just so tenants can't be like, oh, they never showed up. We can be able to pull that up and, and say, well, they tried scheduling this day and called you several times at this point. Um, so it's just a really good tool for tracking the property and making sure it's being um, taken care of by vendors and, and any maintenance issues. Um, the LCS VOIP is our phone system. Um, that ties in directly to our rent manager property management software. Um, so any calls from tenants um, are recorded in there. That way we can reference back to those if the need arises. Continuing on with the communication tools here, that MAP communication is a 24-7, 365 emergency hotline um, where tenants can always reach us. That is a live person that they will talk to when they call. Um, that's a real big one for a lot of our owners. I don't know if you've ever rented somewhere and say you locked yourself out or had an, a, an overnight or weekend emergency and you call and you get you know Bubba's voicemail and um, just nothing can be done. Um, when they call that emergency hotline with us, it's going to be a live person that's going to get um, on the other line and be able to take care of and necessary action to send the right vendor or um, get things handled in, in, a, in a correct response amount of time to, to make sure we're, one, just protecting your property if there is something catastrophic or helping someone you know in, in a moment of need on that. Um, the Z Inspector is an app that all of our employees have on our phone. Um, it helps us provide continuous contact. Um, with our tenants. Um, I'll have a little bit more in depth on that here shortly. The Listen360 is a continuous survey of tenants that we have to ensure quality of service. Um, we really try to set the bar high and, and we wanna make sure that we're providing you know quality service to, to everybody involved with our company. Um, we feel that that's part of the reason we've been in business for, for the 10 years here. 
um, and, and a growing business with um, great reviews from owners just to make sure you know we're doing our job and, and taking care of your property as we should be. Um, we use full social media. We have accounts on all major um, social platforms. Um, this allows us to reach out to not only tenants and owners but possible tenants um, as well as we mark um, as we market your properties on social media um, and boost those to really make sure we're, we're in front of a broad audience with as many people as we can um, just to, to get somebody moved into your property as soon as we can. Um, so that's a big one for us as well. Um, some of the community ties that we have, of course, the MLS. We have four licensed real estate agents on staff um, that all do you know, the necessary things to maintain their MLS status. Um, they're NAR, um, the National Association of Real Estate and Property Managers, NARPM, um, ties that we have. We, of course, National Association of Realtors and the Colorado Association of Realtors. Um, we also belong to the Women's Council of Realtors. Um, here in Colorado, as well as several other different platforms. Um, and I can send you a little bit more in-depth information on that in the packet that we send. Um, so you can read through that as well. So now what happens after you hire us? Um, we're gonna sit down and we're gonna get to know your property. We're gonna fill out this property worksheet. Um, basically helps us build a digital model, if you will, of, of your house, um, when it's gonna be ready for move in, when the vacancy will be, what we wanna start the listing price at, um, if the rent's going to include any HOA fees, utilities, etc., cetera, um, how we're going to do with pets, what kind of pets, dogs only, no cats, cats only, et cetera, uh, no pets. Um, another thing this is going to help us do is um, like the breaker box, for example, where that's located if there is a blackout or something and we need to get a vendor in there overnight. We can say, hey, the breaker box is on this wall in this room or um, in the garage here. Um, here's where the main water turn off is. If you go under the house there, it's going to be right there to your right. So this is a really good worksheet we use to kind of build your house, like I said, digitally and, and make sure we know what we have um, for vendors or um, just information in general. Um, we're going to do initial walkthrough and, and know anything that needs to be fixed or clean. Um, if there is any you know issues that we need to get a vendor out for to take care of before we put tenants in. Um, the main reason for that is we really want to give a tenant the property and the condition that we expect them to give it back to us at. Um, for example, we don't want to give them a dirty property and let them move out and leave it dirty. Um, so we just make sure everything's up to a pretty decent standard. Um, that helps us protect your property in the long run and, and give, you know, hopefully bring in a little more rent and take care of it a little better for you. So we'll take pictures inside and out. Um, we do a 360 photo. We can do a video walkthrough. Um, that's been really crucial here over the last uh, few months for us with the way things are. Um, and then um, we'll start the marketing process. So as we do the marketing process, we'll do the market evaluation. You also receive the initial one um, in the packet that we send you, but it'll just give us an idea of what similar houses in your area are renting for or similar townhomes, condos, et cetera, um, same bedrooms, bathrooms, et cetera, what those are renting for and kind of how to expect things. Um, and help you know provide the most money and, and income property that we can for. Um, marketing um, our main tool that we use is show mojo so we're going to build your um, ad in there um, we use lots of pictures um, walk through videos and, and we use the pictures to also create a video um, once this information is built into show mojo that's going to syndicate out to all the different websites that we market on um, right now we're advertising on over 50 websites um, we pay top dollar for Zillow marketing and all the syndications that they use. We also have a full-time um, search engine optimization a lady that does a great job of, of the social media marketing and, and showing what keywords and web crawlers are going to hit the best to not only you know market your house the best, but put your house in front of the most qualified audience that we can um, if they're looking for a house in your area. Um, that all ties back into the rent manager. Um, and the property meld so we can say, hey, you know, I know you've had experiences in the past, but this is how we do things here. Um, everything's documented and tracked for you. Um, yeah, and then, of course, we'll put up in the MLS here so that local agents can see that as well. If they have a homeowner that maybe can't buy yet but needs a rental, we can also market that way for them too and you. Um, our tenant screening is a very thorough process um, when a tenant's inquire about your property. Um, we'll get them through a showing, and if they decide that they want to put an application in, um, we'll begin the process. Uh, the main tool that we use there is AM Rent. It's integrated with all of our other platforms um, to kind of just tie in and make everything go smoothly. Um, we believe that good screening helps keep a tenant longer, puts a good qualified tenant in there, 
um, and it kind of helps reduce skips and evictions and no pays. So um, it's really important to us to do as thorough of a job. We have a great team that does the tenant screening process, so um, and they do that full time for us. So it's a it's a really unique and and, and great program that we use. Um, if we do allow pets in the property, we also essentially um, mandate the pets go through kind of a, a background check as well. It's called PetScreening.com. Um, you can check that out too. Um, it's kind of a, a third party liability protection, helps make sure that if it is a service animal, it validates that and any necessary paperwork that needs to come with that. Um, and it helps create a com uh, comprehensive pet profile for your pet so you know we know what's going in there and make sure that it's got a positive history and, and stuff like that. Um, once that's all done, um, we will have them sign the lease. Um, our lease is molded over 30 years of business. Um, we'll make sure the tenants understand the lease completely from start to finish to avoid any future problems. Um, we have an, a, a YouTube video online that you can check out um, called Signing Your Lease and that helps, uh, helps tenants walk through and you can also see that our proprietary lease as well. Signing Your Lease, Part 2, Paying Your Rent. Paying your rent on time is the most important thing you do as a tenant. The rent is due on the first of each month and is considered late on the second. Um, once the tenant is in place and things are running smoothly, what happens? Um, once the tenants are in there, um, we keep the ongoing management, um, keeping vacancies short um, and handle tenant disputes. Um, best case scenario is we get some good tenants in there um, and they want to stay for 15 years and, and never pay a late month's rent. Um, we do have lots of long-time um, tenants in, in lots of the properties that we manage, so um, that's just a, a shout to our apps team and what a wonderful job they do. Um, once they move out or if there is any issues, we will deal with the legal um, side of things and evictions. We have a full-time um, real estate um, property management attorney that handles that for us. Um, all they do is property management law. Um, they do a great job doing that. Um, we're also going to routinely inspect your property um, with monthly drive-bys. Um, what we do there is we'll cruise by the property, snap a couple pictures of the front, uh, make sure that the blinds aren't busted up or, you know, if there's a yard that the weeds aren't overgrowing um, and trash in, you know, in the hallway or, or anything like that on the porch. So um, we'll do that once a month and then twice annually we'll do a full walkthrough. So we will notify the tenants, um, let them know well, we're going to be here on this day and we'll actually go into the house and take a few pictures of the inside make sure they're protecting the property and, and keeping it up to our standards um, we have great team of vendors on our side if there is maintenance issues um, they do a really good job of giving us preferred rates because we send them so much business um, and we pass those savings on to you uh, one thing that's a big thing for us and you'll see is that you will see um, every invoice that happens on your property um, we don't mark those up there's no um, income generated there on our behalf um, basically we want to get you the best deal we can on any maintenance deals and, and we pass that on to you um, and then um, once the monthly rent's paid we're going to get all the bills cycled through and we're going to deposit that into your uh, account with that direct deposit so um, that always goes out by the 10th they're no later than the 10th um, the way it kind of breaks down is the tenants pay their rent on the first and then if there is any bills due um, once that cycles through um, gets deposited, clears, and then your bills go out, um, then our accountant will send that out to you. But again, that is no later than the 10th that that's sent out for you. Um, going back to the mail, the tenants will be able to report any maintenance issues through the portals. Again, that is tracked. We can see a documented history of if um, and what uh, may have happened. Um, the tenants have several ways to pay rent, um, making it easier for them to pay. There is you know, cash apps. They can go into a Walmart or a King Supers and pay that way. Um, they can pay online or they can put a check and, and bring it by the office. Um, so there's really no reason for them not to be able to pay. Um, the, the cash pay is a big one around the holidays um, when people are out of town like, oh, hey, um, I forgot to pay my rent. What can I do? We can be like, hey, are you close to a Walmart? Yes, I am. Um, then send them in and, and they can pay their, their rent that day. Um, the ta uh, tenant non-payment is handled within days. Um, when eviction is necessary, our experts move into action. Um, we get everything correctly documented and filed with the legal team um, by the Colorado law and, and legislature that's passed uh, to make sure we're doing everything legally, but, but we do not waste a moment to get that handled when, when necessary. Um, and then when a new tenant is uh, needed, as soon as we're ready to market, uh, we do that immediately, immediately as well. We like to keep that turnover low. Um, we see on average from move out to new tenant move in, it's about two weeks and that's full inspections and, and advertising and everything there. Um, that way we don't really skip a beat at all. So 
We also have the ability to add a spouse to the lease, um, or if there's any other life changes, we're able to handle that for tenants as well. Um, and that just kind of helps with, you know, keeping tenants going and, and on the right foot and, and moving forward with us. Ongoing owner services. Um, as an owner, you will have access to your income and expenses 24 hours a day, seven days a week through your own owner portal. Um, you will be notified of any maintenance issues and you'll be able to approve the work before it's done. Um, we'll be able to continue to do the drive-bys and send those out to you if you'd like. Um, and then when you're ready to buy another investment property, we have full-time realtors on staff that can help you purchase another one. Or if you're thinking about selling, we can help you with that too. Um, this is a partnership with you and, and with our company, and, and we want to be able to provide as many services and professional services we can for you, and we really take pride in doing that. Um, our mission is to ensure every property owner has a competent and honest professional to manage their, their most valuable asset. Um, when you make money, we're making money. So yeah, it's, it's really important to us to get good tenants in there and keep them in there. Um, you know, if things are going smoothly, you're not hearing from us and, and just money's getting deposited into your account every month. Um, but we pride ourselves on being able to take care of the issues when they do arise, if they do arise, um, and handle it professionally and, and in the most cost effective way that we can for you. Um, we hope to keep you long term and, as owners and, and earn that trust. We get lots of referrals because of owners that, you know, say we do a good job and have, have kept us for several years with them. Here's a few testimonials. If you'd like to read through those, um, you can pause it. Um, but we have, you know, lists of these. These are kind of some of our favorite ones with people, you know, in and out of town that have, have left us reviews over the years.